Satnam. I'm rising from Chile. I have been a Sikh for eight years. What inspired me to be a Sikh was the model. Like, you know, in my society, uh, we don't have like a higher state or a higher model. Uh, basically, you have politicians, you have like uh, your dad or the family, but you don't know like real men or, or like something that can inspire you. So when I, when I knew about the Sikhs and the, the Gurus, it was like, wow, that's something that I can relate to. And I start to learn. And in some moment in that uh, learning, in that learning process, I, I just get touched. What else I know that is so high in as a model? So I, I didn't th think twice and I, I become a sick. Well, I am from Venezuela and in Venezuela, um, I was like uh, the first Sikh in my town, like wearing ban and all those things. And it was kind of shocking, first of all, for my family and then with the rest of the people, because actually I was in the university and the first time that they saw me on Bana, they were like, what? What is it? Why, why are you wearing a turban? And um, well, I started to like share with the people what is to be a Sikh, not just for the Bana, but for other things too. It's not just to wear a turban, but it's like an attitude, like being, um, being a real person, but having a, a very straight um, spiritual path. Sat Sri Akal, Wai Guru Ji Ka Khalsa, Wai Guru Ji Ki Fateh. My name is Satsan Sarsing. I'm from Chile. I've been a Sikh for 19 years. Reflecting back, my first impressions on um, what I first got from Sikhi was uh, how people were at the end of the Gurudwara during the Langar space. That's what really kind of touched me. The, um, the general vibe, the general atmosphere on the Langar space right after Gurudwara. So everybody was so happy and uh, you know the kind of conversations that were happening in a very creative mood that was my uh, my feeling then that uh, I felt very happy in those spaces and uh, right after Gurdwara so after some time I started feeling like well the, there's got to be something in this that makes people moods change and uh, make people connect to each other in a creative space and uh, with a lot of joy so that really touched me, that really inspired me to keep going to Gurdwara, to keep connecting with people, to keep um, getting involved into projects and uh, it all unfolded from there basically. I wear a turban and bana every day and I feel that that's an important sale, especially in Latin America as it is not well known, Sikhism. So people actually are very open to know about it. I, I'm, when I am always walking on the street, people are always asking me, like, why are you looking that way? Why are, why are you wearing a turban? You really look so pretty. And people really respond very um, positively. When I hear the mantras, uh, I feel something. I don't know why, what thing, but uh, I, um, begin to explore the Gurbani and read the, the Siri Guru Granth Sahib and uh, Guru Nanak take my heart, my heart. Guru Nanak give me the, the, the key to the God's door. I went to my first like Gurdwara or a New Year's Eve celebration and I bow my head for the first time and my heart opened, I don't know, like a flow of energy, <laughs> of love. That was it. I cried, of course. <laughs>